Earth's surface. Written by Rhonda Lucas Donald. Introduction. Earth is your home. Earth's surface is where you live and play. You can run in a field or ride a bike on the sidewalk. You can jump into the water and swim. Look at Earth's surface from space. The brown and green patches are land. The blue areas are water. Which do you think makes up more of Earth's surface? Land or water? All living things depend on Earth's land and water. You do too. Land Earth is called a rocky planet. The land is mostly made of rock. Rocks are hard chunks of earth materials. What else makes up Earth's land? Soil is also part of Earth's surface. Without soil, most plants could not grow. Soil is mostly tiny bits of rock. Those tiny bits come from big rocks that break down over time. Bits of dead plants and animals also get mixed in, along with water. Earth's land has many shapes. Some land is flat, like on a farm. Some land is pointed, reaching high into the sky to make huge mountains. Caves and canyons are also part of Earth's surface. Do you know? There are mounts and canyons under the oceans. The tallest mountain on Earth is Mauna Kea in Hawaii. But most of it is underwater. Only the top part sticks out above the water. Water. Only parts of Earth's surface are dry land. Much more of our planet's surface is covered with water. Most of it is salt water in the ocean. Fresh water is found in lakes and rivers. Ice sheets at Earth's poles are made of fresh water, too. Fresh water is even found in the ground. All that water is always moving. Some ocean water turns into a gas. It forms clouds. Rain and snow fall from clouds onto the land. As water falls, some of it goes into the soil. Some of it fills up rivers and lakes. Most rivers take the water back to the ocean. Now, the water has made a round trip. Earth's changing surface. You just learned that water is always moving. What about land? It may seem the same all the time, but guess again.
Earth's surface is changing all the time. Sometimes soil or loose rocks slide down slopes because of gravity. Sometimes water or wind makes them become loose. Over many years, water and wind can wear down rocks and move them around. The land takes on new shapes, called landforms. Caves, canyons, and valleys are landforms. So are mountains and cliffs. Water and land are always on the move. Imagine what Earth might look like in the future. Most changes to Earth's surface happen over a long, long time. But not all of them. A volcano can build a mountain in just a few days. Earthquakes also change Earth's surface quickly. An earthquake happens when a large part of Earth's surface suddenly moves. Earth is our home. Earth is a special planet because it is home to so many living things. Earth's surface gives living things what they need to survive, such as food and a place to live. Living things also need water. Without water, living things, including people, could not survive. Earth's surface supplies everything people need. We drink fresh water. We grow food in soil and raise animals on the land. We get metal and rocks from the ground to make things. Gas and coal from the ground run our cars and warm our homes. Do you know? Plastic is not found in nature. But to make plastic, people use oil from Earth's surface. Conclusion Earth's surface is covered with land and water. The land is made of rocks and soil and it takes many shapes. Both land and water are always changing. Living things use Earth's surface for a place to live. Earth's surface also supplies food and water. Earth has everything needed for life. It is our beautiful home.